Good morning. Welcome back to Driven by Adventure. I am Frank. I, if you've been coming back to my videos and watching them, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Believe me, thank you. I, I don't know how I'm doing. I don't know if I'm doing really good at these or not. I, I really don't know. I'm learning. This is, this, this is new to me right here. This, this talking to you is new to me. Um, going out to these, these adventures that I take every weekend. This is not, this is old. I've never thought about doing this. I, I was told I should do this take. I should have been doing this a long time ago. I, I really should. I've been doing this for over 40 years and going out into the deserts, basically from California this way and, and towards Palm Springs and Joshua Tree and, and uh, up to Central California, you know, going uh, up to, to the mountains and going into mines and just camping all over the place and exploring everywhere out there. I should have been doing this a long time ago and not realizing how big this right here has gotten. Totally crazy. I mean, totally blowing my mind. And, um, and it's just going out, going out hiking and exploring this vast desert of ours or our mountains. And that's all it's about. And, but taking you with me and explore and looking at all the stuff I look at that I think is pretty cool or fascinating because basically what we're doing with Driven by Adventure is we're driving out to these locations which takes you know anywhere from an hour up to, to six to seven, up to eight hours, let's just say. Eight hours being the length of my driving period. And if it's an eight hour drive, I basically get to my location, set up camp, camp for the night, and then we explore the next day. And uh, usually those are a two day trip maybe a three-day trip because of the, uh, the, the length of my drive uh, it takes a toll on you. So, um, yeah, so I, I get to these locations and then the adventure begins. It, it, where and what I'm doing, I don't know. You know, my wife asked, where are you going? I don't know, I'm just gonna drive. <laughs> you know, I give her a, a, a pretty much a central location of where I'm going. Uh, I can send her my pinpoint of once I get there so she knows where I'm at and you know she knows I'm safe so I can do that um, so but I don't really know where I'm going until I get there and I know where I'm at now we're in the Mojave National Preserve the Mojave Desert uh, just in between uh, Nevada and California so basically we're in California right now and we're up against the uh, uh, mountains uh, I don't know if you can see him in the background, but we are in the desert, driving through the desert right now. We're not on a freeway or anything like that. We're on a back road, driving down a back road, and we're going to explore some hidden treasures that are out here that I know other YouTubers probably have already seen. I've seen these things so many times. I just never thought about it, putting them on uh, YouTube. And okay. Well, let's let's find some new places. Let's find some places that haven't been discovered yet. Which last weekend, if you haven't look, watch watch this video here. That's right up here uh, from last weekend, and that place, that compound, was a trip. I mean, really was a trip. I I, I really don't know what happened there or, or why, but that place yet has not been touched. It looks like someone went through and just destroyed everything, but they, I believe it was the person, the people that were living there. I believe they got what they needed to get out of there and got out and left everything. So they just kind of threw shit all over the place. I believe that's what happened. So give me a sec, I'll be right back. All right, sorry about that. I, um, I know it's only a quick second like that, but I had to look at my map to make sure I'm going in the right location. So I just gave a quick look at the map here real fast to make sure I'm heading the right way, which I am. I gotta watch out, I got a road I gotta turn down. And uh, once I get to that road, I, or dirt road, I have to then air down so that uh, I get a nice smooth ride across the desert here. Um, we're going over some railroad tracks right now. Out 
in the middle of <laughs> the great word nowhere but we aren't in the middle of nowhere we are in the Mojave National Preserve is where we're at and out here there is a lot of houses that they're not even houses they're just some of them are houses so if you if you go back in some of my videos uh, you will see some houses uh, here so check them out check these videos out right here they're really cool um, it's amazing I mean really really amazing these houses that these people build out here they literally build their home I mean this is where they think they're gonna live for the rest of their life is out here in the in the, in the Mojave National uh, Preserve the desert but something happened something happened to this individual or individuals and they just walked away from everything like literally walked away from everything they put into this house these places so that last video I, I was talking about before I had to go away and to look at the map nothing was touched yet because usually when you see vehicles out there uh, like like those the Chevy um, the Jeep the Honda the engines are still perfectly intact they're clean they're not dirty they haven't been ripped apart uh, the house the, the mobile home um, stuff is still in it a lot of personal items there's tools uh, I mean holy crap I mean the tools are still there like I didn't touch anything there's generators you saw the generators there's welding machines there's compressors there's all kinds of equipment that have not been taken yet like that is unheard of like literally unheard of usually people who I don't know if they're explorers or not but they go in and then they start taking everything and you know and then they start destroying breaking the windows breaking the walls uh, doing all that crap why people do that I don't know don't don't do that don't don't just leave everything as it is just just leave it and it just seems to be on this side of the of our states it's it's here in California and Arizona and uh, and Utah people got to go in and destroy shoot everything up I don't know why I mean I guess we're all cowboys I guess I don't know but why does everyone have to go shoot things up why do you got to go break the walls and destroy things stop doing that stop it there's no reason for it just enjoy what you see enjoy it look at it walk through it don't touch it just walk through it explore and move on that's it that's what I did and there are explorers out there that do that and thank you because that gives me an opportunity and other people an opportunity to go out and and see that themselves you know I, I think it's pretty cool I mean especially when it's really old stuff and no one's really touched it and I'm gonna go back to those locations uh, that I know that have not been put on video yet so I do have to go back to those locations and record them and kind of be a better person. I am. I do apologize for my previous videos. I'm not that good. I'm sorry. Give me an opportunity to show myself and who I really am. Um, I think I'm a really likable guy. I just got to get used to this. I talking to you individually out there. I got to get used to this. This is not something I'm used to. I'm just usually walking around and go, oh, cool. Oh, look at this. This is really cool. Wow, look at that. You know, that's normally what I'm doing. That's that's it. I don't usually have a camera or cameras in my hand. It's just me walking around, picking up things, putting things back and stuff like that. Um, so, again, I, I said in the beginning, if you're returning a viewer, thank you. If you have not subscribed, Please hit that subscribe button. Show me you you're, you like what you see and you're all about what about this kind of stuff. These un, basically uncharted locations. I, I think they're uncharted. I don't think people have really quite figured this out yet, you know, or found these places yet. And I'm, I'm glad 
to have found them. I really am because I think it's cool. And uh, uh, looking at the railroad tracks, I'm crossing some railroad tracks right now. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna pull off over here to the side, and I'm gonna air down my tires, and then we're gonna move on up this road, and we're going to explore this vast desert, this Mojave Desert that that's right in front of me right now. It is just, I'm gonna show you here in a few seconds and uh, show you where we're going and what we're going to explore. And you're gonna realize like there's nothing here. It's just desert, creosote bushes, some sage brush, brush um, Joshua trees, there are some yuccas, um, but mainly a lot of sagebrush, uh, creosotes, Joshua trees, and some yuccas, and that's it. That's that's all this is. I, I got a semi-page road right here in front of me. I'm going to air down my tires, and we're going to move on, and we'll see you in a bit. Thanks for watching. All right, let me show you what I got set up. So I get all four tires hooked up right now. To the system here. So, it takes about two minutes to do this. And then, um, oh crap, I gotta turn the battery on. Alright, so we're showing 35 pounds of pressure, so we're gonna go ahead and open the valve. We'll look at that. We'll, we'll go down to 15 psi. Uh, that's, that kind of gives me a nice smooth drive across the desert, so um, it won't be as rough. It'll be nice and smooth, smooth ride. Um, this is a 2019 Toyota 4Runner TRD Off-Road Premium. Uh, the Premium package is basically the KDSS system that's in it. Um, it's got a three and a half inch lift, 34 inch tires. It's got a sun. Uh, rooftop tent, solar panels. I got a refrigerator. I got I got a uh, power inside here. I got a new battery system. We're at 25 psi right now. I got food. Gas cans. I got five gallons of gas. I got propane. Um, I got a 270 awning on this side. I got water on both sides. One for washing, one for using for cooking. Um, I also have a portable diesel heater that I put on that side and hook up. So when I need it, just check this pressure here real quick. This was a couple minutes. shower but I also use that as the uh, bathroom. As a bathroom. Uh, yeah this is uh, my vehicle getting around and it gets me everywhere I need to go everywhere literally we are at 17 so all four tires will be check this out we're gonna see what's inside so come along with me let's check it out oh just so you know I there's no information there's no history about this place this place is just built here um, when I don't know how long ago I don't know it's, it's like kind of like a farm it's on a, a few I don't know maybe usually it's like 40 acres so it's like 40 acres of land so let's go let's go check it out all right i hear something i don't know where it's at i don't know if it's inside I don't know if it's 
It's outside. Hello? Hello? You know, uh, fortunately, it's like an ale. This is pretty much it. We got curtains, the windows. Heater, I guess. I don't know, maybe I think that is. Cast iron. Yeah, cast iron. Let's go back out the same way we came in, but this is it. We'll close the door this time and prevent the, the unfortunate owl that uh, died in here. Interesting, huh? That the, uh, remember these? Food trays or lap trays when you'd sit up on the couch and eat dinner and you undo those and put them over your your lap and you'd have your food these ones got pictures on them Really doesn't close, so huh. there's a whole another half down there, which we only went in to right here. This was the bathroom. Well, let's go check this out. <clears throat> collapsed I got a jar <clears throat> interesting those are what that is what kind of rock that is anybody know Plates. Hammer. Ball peen hammer. Crescent wrench. It's like the bedroom corridors.
Kind of sucks when they collapse like that. back there big old bumblebee the rock. I'm not a geologist so don't know what kind of rocks these are. Pretty cool though. If you're a rock hound, look at that one. Look at that. Got stickers there. Bring you back over there. See you in a second. Okay, so I changed my mind. We came over here to look at all of this. I mean, it's pretty cool. It's pretty old because look at these locks on the doorknobs and the hinges. Look at these hinges. They're cool. So, there's lots of them. Pretty neat. What's that? This must have been the garage. Bottle jack. Look at this. Clamp. Chain. Yeah, this place is pretty old. sink right there. It's a box. What kind of box was it? It's a jar or something in there. It's a drawer. Okay, we'll go over here and check it out. I'll bring you right back. All right. Well, of course, you got some modern things here Pepsi. Look at this grinding wheel. an inch. What's this? Ooh. 
boot. And meets in there, extra. There's the hinges. Whole thing of them. Sucks that these things just fall down and really ain't much left to look at, but digging around through them. So, this must be where they brought their cattle, I'm guessing. By the looks, it's cattle up here. Free range, which still roam around here. Which we'll probably end up seeing some. Look at this. Let me go in the other direction so you know my shadow here. Yeah. <laughs> what kind of car was this? see it I'll have to look at it later the gauges on and off there's a bone down there it's a bone the tr transmission so something was set up right here Comment. I want to. I would like to know what this was. What they used this for. Oh, here's another bone. There's some, like pieces of bones right here. Stinks in here. That's crazy. I don't know what that is. It's plastic. All over the walls. It's like a, it's like a newspaper, but in, in plastic. It's all plastic. It's like a plastic newspaper.
in this old crate. It's pretty cool. I'll put it back and see what's inside. Get my light out. Like dead mice, <laughs> dead rats. Those are rats right there, and there's a little baby mouse. A couple dead mice in there. Obviously, they got stuck. Couldn't get out. See him? All right, let's put this back on. <clears throat> Back up. Oh, looks like oil. Must be where the cattle came. Okay. Down there. It's crazy. The scratching sound behind me sounds like a dog panting. <laughs> Sorry for the grunting. There's that tin. Oh, that's heavy. Wow, that's pure steel, solid iron, I'm guessing. It's really cool. Balancing work here. Yeah. Oh, that's the siding. It's used for siding. Look at the old boots right there. The old white boots. All this tie wire. Holy moly, there's a lot. I don't know what it's covering, but it's covering something. Bench, bench out there. There's a bench, somewhat. Yeah, it's just empty. I don't know what. That's heavy. That's thick. All those jars. <laughs> Look at this one. Oh. 
global globe. There's liquid in it. I don't know what it is. I have no idea. There's a name on it. This is the, this is their trash. That's what this is. This is where they threw all their trash back here. Man, these are rims, old rims. So I'm guessing this place has been here for quite a while. Don't know how long, look at this one. Is this uh, to a wagon? Look at that. Look at it. What do you think? I'm telling you, I can spend a long time. Look at this. Look, it's got wooden, wooden spokes. Oh crap, my shadow. Sorry. Look at that. What do you think that was for? turn so whatever water a pump maybe is this a pump were they pumping water what is this so it's connected to this this whole entire system here and it obviously it spun around man there's some crazy stuff here like i said this is uh this is their trash pile. This is where all their trash went to. And I don't know if any of this stuff is old or not. Like I said, I can see people have been here, but there's a frame to a car truck maybe this is the frame to that engine over there water and here sorry here's the uh, look at this rear axle look at the look at the wheels or I don't know I'm it's all wood Look at the brakes. That drive line's all connected, no joints. Here's another one. Sorry, the sun is in. It's, what time is it? It's 12 o'clock, so the sun is directly above me. So it's causing so much shadows. Yeah. Here's some more bones. Lots of bones down there. So I'm guessing that's a, a den. I 
see shovels, another mattress. These are blades? Yeah, these are blades. And uh, this one looks old. This one looks really old. We're gonna check this one out. Showing you what I'm looking at here. This has been uh, taken over by the animals, that's for sure. Lots of rat droppings. Nineteen seventy seven. Is this the original calendar? I don't know. But if it, this goes back to 1977. Old. Straw hat. Maybe seven. And the stove. Uh oh, oh, door open. What do you think? Huh? Think it's the wind? 1977, same thing. Oh, that's solid. again Ooh, floor soft that one's 79 so this calendar 79 and it's all right now right here 1979. Doors closed again. You think it'll open again? Oh my. Whew. This is just pure poop. I got my mouth covered and my nose covered right now. <clears throat> Scope. Oh, it's a step down room. Oh, there's a big nest over there. Must be the closet.
Oh, American flag. Good for them. No flag. This was an add-on. It's like a porch. Made it into the living rooms. So basically, this was just a one bedroom. You get the dining kitchen area and then the bedroom. <clears throat> that was it. The bathroom's out, outside, so there's no bathroom in here. It was an outhouse. That's hitting the roof. Must know where the no, I don't know what was here. It's melted. Glass is falling out. We were over there. Sure, the American flag was that. This big old little box here. So it's got to be outside. So let's go outside. Let's see if we go out this door. Nope. Okay. Oop. Go around. Swing. It's interesting, ain't it? Huh. What do you think? I noticed that box that was right there. Swing. All right. So we didn't look into those ones over there. So let's walk over here. We're in there. This is the additional. I'm guessing water heater. Bathroom. Shower. Yeah. Can't be a tall person. Tall. Tin siding. It's crazy. Is here's the drain right there. That's the drain for the shower. Look, we got a glory hole. Yeah. Okay, let's close that back up. <clears throat> Look at this. Dash soap. Look at that. 
Kenmore. I'm guessing this is a heater. What is that, water? What is that? Is that the stove? Hmm. All the cardboard boxes for insulation. This is interesting. What was this room? Animals? That's that bathroom right here. <clears throat> Dresser. Let me uh, lift you up. Let's see what's up here. I won't see it till later. Well, thank you for joining me if you've stayed this long and uh, explored this old abandoned uh, house or compound or homestead here in uh, the Mojave Desert. I thank you for sticking with me and enjoying this adventure we are going to move on and head out to the desert more out that way and see what else we can find and go from there if, if you like what you what you saw please give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button we'll see you in the next adventure thanks